Welcome to this session on how Google Cloud is delivering enterprise transformation at scale. My name is Mahmoud El Asir, and I lead customer experience for our strategic accounts at Google Cloud. I joined Google in late 2019 after spending over two decades at Verizon, where I had multiple technology leadership roles, like the senior vice president and CIO for our files business, and in the past four and a half years, I was the senior vice president and CTO for IT, where I led the Verizon journey to the cloud with AWS, Oracle, GCP, and started the transformation of Verizon into a data-driven powerhouse. It's interesting to note how technology changes so fast. In 2016, AWS was the right choice for data center migration just like the mainframe was the right choice in the 70s and 80s. Today, it's all about multi-cloud. It's all about applied AI. So I cannot be more excited to be here at Google, building our enterprise experience and, and teams and uh, helping our most strategic customers unlock the superior uh, capabilities of Google Cloud and helping them to transform and win faster. Our mission and customer experience is to help our customer adopt and realize value from Google Cloud solutions. We win when our customers win. I hope you had a chance to watch John Jester and Melanie Bragg's session, which goes into deep uh, into how we're investing and building our customer experience organization. Today, I have two objectives. One. Uh, first, I would like to highlight how we're orienting our customer experience to, to support our most strategic customers. Then I want to share a few examples on the work we are doing to support our strategic customers across different industries. We're building deep expertise for enterprise in every region and every industry to help our customers transform and win globally. And this list is growing rapidly with many new kind of partnerships that we're announcing during Next On Air over the nine weeks uh, period. By listening deeply to our customers, you, and we have built our uh, strategy under Thomas's leadership and we are creating a customer experience organization with more depth credibility, and enterprise readiness. Within customer experience, we have five main pillars. Our professional services teams now can help you with data center migration, with mainframe migration, and with scaling AI and ML uh, solutions. We restructured our support team to have more customer context and to have deeper expertise in the products and services of Google Cloud. Also earlier this year, we launched a premium support offering with a mission critical support option that will give you five minutes P0 SLO. Our learning team recently launched skills and knowledge badges and certification program to help you build deep expertise into our modern technologies. Our customer success team is continuously is uh, engaging with you to help you accelerate the time to onboard on our cloud and to build your customer success plan, helping you realize value faster from our solutions. And we continuously build our and improve our products and services by listening to you, our customers, also the feedback we get from our partners. So that's a huge investment we're also making this year. And lastly, so we're building my team, which is the, I would say the transformation officers team so this is a team of industry CIOs and CTOs that we're hiring uh, to cover our strategic customers in every industry. And they bring two items to the table. First, they, they bring deep industry knowledge in the respective industries we're focusing on. And two, they bring credibility of having led uh, uh, technology transformation at scale uh, in, that, in that industry. Let's go a little bit deeper into these transformation officer roles. There are three key ways they help you uh, transform. First of all, they provide strategic thought leadership for you and your team through this uh, transformation journey and adopting cloud. 
And the way kind of the, the transformation officers focus on a handful of clients, like two to three customers at a time. And this will allow them to spend lots of time and collaborate with you and your team to help you uh, be the uh, transform in, in your business and win in your markets. At the same time, these transformation officers will act as the coaches for our Google side and continuously work with our team to continuously de-risk uh, the program and help them kind of think as a, be in the shoes of the customer and build customer empathy and uh, continuously de-risking to ensure delivery. And the third area, these transformation officers work across Google and Google Cloud with other partners like Google Health and Verily and Google Travel and Google Automotive Services and Android and everywhere in Google to help pull these expertise to help you differentiate in your transformation and deliver faster. So as you can see, you get lots of, lots of support uh, when you work with us. Here's an example of the Google Cloud customer team. As you can see, there are many individuals on this page, all of whom are here to support you uh, through this journey of, of partnering with us and migrating to the cloud. The transformation officer play a key role in engaging with you and your leadership team, as well as providing guidance to our account team. This is a service that we provide throughout the delivery. And it is something that we believe differentiate Google Cloud. Here are a few examples. I want to start with the healthcare industry. So we just hired Ryan Terry, who was the business president at Hillerom, which is a medical kind of uh, platform, device platform. Uh, he's done lots of transformation in, in the healthcare industry. So the healthcare industry has been at the forefront of the fight against COVID, working tirelessly to accelerate drug development, meet heightened demand for PPE, and rethink the delivery of patient care. There are three areas we're focusing on with our healthcare uh, customers. First one is telehealth. The global pandemic has proven that telehealth is an effective way to deliver care. According to McKinsey Research, consumer adoption of telehealth has skyrocketed from 11% to 46%, and 74% of telehealth users have reported satisfaction. Our team is working with several providers to build clinical and patient-friendly telehealth platforms with easy integration to hospital scheduling and EHR systems. The other area is advanced clinical research with faster times to drug approval and better patient outcomes is a priority. We are using our unparalleled tools in, in high-performance computing and AI ML to develop sophisticated models to expedite the drug discovery and approval process. And finally, we're working with hospitals to enable better decision-making for caregivers and within business functions throughout the use of analytical tools with more streamlined ways to access data from disparate systems. Shifting gears to the, the financial services industry, and this is where we hire like David Knott, as the, he was the chief architect at HSBC. So our financial services customers are on an exciting and journey and challenging journey also to redefine the banking experience. They all want to transform the experience for their customers. They want to reduce risk and they want to reduce, increase collaboration among their teams. We're currently partnering with our financial services customers to mainly do a few things. One, they want to migrate off the mainframe and build cloud native platforms for banking, which allow them to innovate and, and more faster for their customers and change the experience uh, and be much more nimble and agile. The other area is they want to reimagine the customer experience with the use of data and, and, and machine learning and they're building 360 view of the customer, which is helping them build more customized and tailored offers and, and services for their customers. And lastly, we are also co-creating new products with, uh, with, our, with our financial services customers, especially for when it comes to fraud and anti-money laundering and so forth and so on. And this is where we're matching their kind of expertise with our AI and ML superior capabilities and talent to transform uh, and create these products. 
Another industry here I have is telecom, and that's dear to my heart. And we have, we have two transformation officers in the space to cover our customers globally. One is Kevin Schatzkammer. So Kevin recently joined us from Dell. He was the CTO for the service provider industry. And the other one is Frederick uh, Vanut Heise, and he was the CTIO at Megaphone. Uh, so Kevin is on board. Frederick will be joining us next month. And we're so excited to have them. Our telecom customers want to monetize their 5G investments and transform into data-driven powerhouses to drive both capital and expense uh, efficiencies. They're also looking for new ways to innovate and provide better experience for their customers. So we're working with them in like three key areas. The first one is transforming their customer experience. So we're launching, we launched this product called Contact Center AI, which is allowing our, our telecom customers to do two things, transform their customer experience and their cost structure at the same time. Contact Center AI allows our customers to auto-create both chatbots and voice bots with our superior kind of text-to-speech and speech-to-text capability, which is NLP capabilities. And we have amazing uh, results in this space. And, and this product applies not just to telecom, it applies to any industry uh, or customer that, have, uh, that are heavy on uh, call centers. The second area, we're expanding our mobile edge foot footprint and partnering with multiple telcos in this space to transform both the consumer and create new enterprise experiences that will harness the power of low latency and, and high throughput. Finally, we are using applied analytics and AI ML capabilities to help our customers uh, drive efficiency in their capital and expense spend uh, through like a tool. We have a new tool. I encourage everybody to come and talk to us about it called uh, Network Planner. Shifting gears into uh, travel and transportation. So we hired Ravi Simham Batla from, he was the CTO at United Airlines. Ravi has been on board for the past, since earlier this year and he's been heavily engaged with our strategic customers in the travel business. Um, and there are fewer industries that have been more impacted by COVID than the travel industry. And rather than scaling back uh, their investments, we have seen our customers use this opportunity to accelerate their digital transformation. And we are very proud to be supporting them during these times. Some of the key areas we're working uh, with our customers across this industry are I would say one is getting them out of their data centers and getting them off the mainframe into our cloud platform and helping them change the culture to be much more agile, build DevOps and build SRE for operations. The other area is they're using our superior AI ML capabilities and talent to drive efficiencies in their operations and especially their irregular operations. Basically when the weather, there's a storm and they need to reschedule everything. So how do you use AI ML for that? How do you plan the last last mile uh, routing? So lots of opportunities here to reinvent that business with our superior capabilities. And finally, we're also partnering with them and, and like this is an area where we call Google Travel into this and to help create new products and services for both consumer and enterprise customers and allow them to make new kind of types of revenue. So these are a few examples I share with you of, of the work we're doing across supporting to support our customers transform and differentiate and innovate across multiple industries. There, there are many more examples. I'm happy uh, to talk about them more in, in a different occasion. In closing, I'd like to leave you with uh, three key takeaways. The first one, I hope you see the customer centricity. We at Google Cloud are all about you our customers and helping you realize value through our products and solutions. The second one, we continue to make big investments to support you, our enterprise customers. The transformation officers are part of that, uh, of that investment. But as you can hear from Thomas and, and, and John, we're tripling the investment in our go-to-market teams. And that's where we're investing in our transformation officers team. And the third area, you can see Google Cloud. Also, we can pull in all the assets across these transformation officers. We'll pull in all the assets from across Google to help you differentiate your experiences for your customers and help you win uh, faster. 
I hope you enjoyed our discussion today. Here are a few final tips to go deeper. And please do not hesitate to reach out to your sales rep if you'd like to set up a conversation with me or anybody from my team. We're happy to go deeper with you and answer any kind of questions or tackle any kind of opportunities uh, you have. We look forward to hearing from you and thank you for tuning in.